Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the Complete Cards channel. Now today we'll be doing a hit check on the Pokemon Crown Zenith Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box. And this is the Plus Box. So we've got two and this should be hype. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel before this video is over. And check out the eBay link in the description of this video. We actually have a break live on eBay right now. We're breaking the exact same product with three boxes instead. Pick your type. I'll go over more details at the end of the video, so definitely stay tuned. So what makes this box a plus? The extra two packs per box, the damage counter dice, the Lucario coin, and the condition markers are all metal. And I'm assuming the code card is probably better. Let me know when y'all scan it. Hit me up in the comments. What's the difference? All right, so we've got the player's guide. I always kind of like breeze through it real quick. It definitely tells you a little bit about what the cards that you can go after. A couple of quick tricks if you want to steal those moves, use them in the game. But the uh, card list is pretty fire. I actually opened up um, the Japanese set of that on the channel. So if you want to check that out, it's there. All right, first thing is here are those metal and then also metal and then should be a marker here up oh, got another one there's the lucario coin there's metal as well and here's our v star marker it's a nice little deck here lucario as well crown zenith Here's all the packs. I mean, that looks awesome right there. Pack of energies. And here are the sleeves there. Oh, check out the uh, separators there. And then here's your code card. Oh, it does say the plus. So I'm guessing there's going to be a little bit extra. And here we go. Look at that promo card right there. Super fire. Super fire. Anything else in here? Nope, that's about it. Alright, here we go. What card are you chasing in this set? I don't even know what I want right now. I feel like everything is fire. So hopefully we can pull some super heat. See what we got going on here. All right, so we're our first trainer gallery card, Thiebel. And then we got a hop. <laughs> I like the drawing up there on the card. Hollow. I feel like that was a, a good start. A hollow and a trainer gallery card. Let's see what else we got. Got the Shinx. Pokeball. Enamorous with the reverse hollow there. Tangrove. V Star Marker. Graveler. Alright, two packs in. Nothing too crazy just yet. Yamma. And we have a reverse hollow core fish, Snorlax, Graveler again. Uh oh. I'm kind of slowing down, but we're only three packs in. Rock Rough, Tangela, Reverse Hollow, Salazzle, and just a regular rare there. Maybe they're saving all the heat towards the end. I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. Cricket Tot, a couple times seeing you. Ooh, a reverse hollow common card and a regular rare. Uh, right now we're kind of getting slayed just a little bit. 
Um, but it did come with 12 packs. We only have one hollow and one trainer gallery card. Execute. Yanma. And we've got a hollow fighting energy right there. If y'all can see that. And then a hollow Zacian. That's a really clean looking Zacian though. Let me know how y'all feel. Are y'all ready for these English cards to have that gray border like the Japanese cards do? I'm not sure if I'm ready. I'm not sure if I'm mentally prepared for this. All right, here we go. Bow toy. Meowth, Shinx, Reverse Hollow Switch, and a regular rare there. All right, last five. What do we need? What do we need right now? We need, I mean, a Radiant Charizard, but we need a gold. We really need a gold. All right, Riolu. Starly. Cali Rex with the Reverse Hollow and a Leafeon V. First V. So... Definitely keeping track. One trainer gallery, one V. A couple rare reverse hollows, and then we did have one hollow trainer card, so that is why we have two to do a hit check. Our right, Wilmer, Pokeball, Core Fish, Oddish, Ultra Ball with the reverse hollow, but it looks like there might be something behind that. Oh, fire. But that's, it's not the right coloring. semi seer V. So two Vs right now. Oh, we also had a hollow energy. So let's see what we can do. So two Vs. Hollow energy. And last pack magic for a gold. <laughs> Bidoof. Sunkern. And we've got another trainer gallery. Altaria. And. Lycan Rock with just the regular rare there. All right, here we go. Last two packs. Two trainer gallery cards. Two Vs. One hollow. Execute. Psychic type. Let's slow roll this one. Love Disc. Trainer gallery card. And that is Lunatone. And a hollow Kyogre. Dark energy. All right, let's let's slow this one. So we got two hollows, three trainer gallery cards, and two Vs. All right, here we go. This is make or break. We're going to really slow roll this one because we really need the good luck. I should have guessed that one. I knew it was going to be grass. But sharp, Graveler. Okay, Pokemon Catcher. We need a Pokemon Catcher right now. Execute. We need a Gold Catcher. Let's go. All right, one more. Here we go. Let's get to the heat. Oh, one more. Reverse Hollow, Whale Lord, and... Ah, that's not looking good. Tauros. Wow. Wow, that was intense. Okay. Woo. Wow. Crown Zenith. What just happened there? That was that was intense. All right. That is why you have a second one. That is absolutely why. Are you guys gonna collect any of the uh, other boxes? I've seen a, a few. Um, I like the uh, blister pack one. Really, the tins can be kind of cool, but I like the blister packs. I wonder which one will have the best results. So this time, since we already know, we're just going to go straight to the packs, leave everything else there. Close this back up. Oh, code card. Where's the code card? There it is. There you go. All right, here we go. 
That was for some magic. <laughs> I need some, we need some magic. Um, it was cool and everything, but I think we need a little bit more. It's a little bit more. There we go. I, I got my shot blocked a few times. Love this. Shout out. Beat Doof. Reverse Hollow. Pawn. And just a regular rare there. V-Star Marker. All right, here we go. Larvesta Seal Potion Aaron, A Aaron, and chat out with the reverse hollow. Oranguru, regular rare there. All right, two packs in. It's a little bit different because in the first in the first box we started out with a trainer gallery card and a hollow in the first pack. So I'm hoping that because we didn't follow that way or that pattern this time, maybe there's a little bit more. A little bit more heat there, and it looks like there may be something back there. Zero or a V star. Let's go. Let's go. And there's something a little bit behind there. Oh, okay. Hey, it looked like it was about to get crazy. So Duraladon V Max and a Zero or a V Star. Nice hit there. Really clean. And a Duraladon. So it does look like, I don't even know, is that a bad box? I can't even say. Because uh, we didn't have we didn't have a VMAX, right? Yeah, no VMAX. No VMAX and no V-Star. So some boxes could just be, ooh, pretty bland. That's that's sick. Tangela. Cricket Tune with the Trainer Gallery card there. And a Hollow Nest. So it looks like you'll probably get one of these because uh, we did have one, like, artist-signed trainer card um one per box but it doesn't look like you can you, you could go a whole box with no v max or v star it looks like larvesta pokeball reverse hollow giraffe rig and a regular rare Here we go. Execute. Rock Rough. Love this. Chat out. And this is going to be one per box, too. One hollow energy. So, hollow lightning energy in Orangaroo. And then another lightning energy. So, those are pretty much guaranteed. So, in that three box break, it'll be three types that will come or leave with a uh, energy that's hollow. Wolo. Snow Runt, what? Okay, I lied. You can have two in one box, so fire energy. Maybe this means that this is a hot box. The hit rate right now, I can't figure it out. I can't figure out what the hit rate is. Um, it keeps changing. It keeps changing. Yes, two hollow energies in one box. V-Star and a V-Max was in one pack. Pan Cham. Something back here. Agron with the reverse hollow and a regular rare executor. Last four packs here. I was going to switch up the order, see if I could guess the heat, but no, we're just going to go straight. We'll go straight through it. See if I can slow roll this a little bit. Shinx, energy retrieval. LaVesta is like a player of the day right here. Reverse hollow coughing and... Oranguru with the regular rare. How many of those do we have today? Bow toy. Another hollow energy Azacian V though. Um, so that's that's pretty interesting, right? I was that's pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. Three hollow energies in one box. I don't know if you need that many. I don't know if you need that many. Uh, Pokemon, what, you, what, what happened here? What, what happened? All right, let's 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 slow roll this one. See if we can get some heat here. Oh, I should have guessed that. Shaman. Scrope. Helio. Wolo. 
Shanks and a Mareep trainer gallery card, followed by a regular rare. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. All right. Maybe we can get a gold. We did have like four energies in this in this box, so let's see what we can do. Soul Rock. Trekking Shoes. Matang. Shinx. Pancham. Snow Runt. Rock Rough. Here we go. Tangela. Reverse Hollow. And... Oh my goodness, Volcarona. Oh my goodness. Wow, that is intense. All right, let's do a uh, let's do a recap. Okay, so to recap, and I want you to kind of envision this. I'm gonna put these to the side. This is kind of like if you were to do the break, what it would look like. Um, but to recap the cards here, I'm actually kind of liking V-Star Universe just a little bit better. I did open like five boxes. Check that video out. It's on YouTube. But yeah, um, Crown Zenith. Wow. ETB, but taking out the reverse hollows first. Um, we did have a few. This is a reverse hollow rare, um, but still a reverse hollow. Cali Rex. That's a common card. And then we had some, yeah, still in the reverse hollows here. And then, yeah, here's the reverse hollow stars. Agron, Enamorous. And then here's the hollow rares here just two out of two boxes we had two kyogre and zacian um we actually picked two v's in the same box so it's not even guaranteed that you'll get uh, a v but we did have semi seer leafion and zacian look really cool though um i can't really tell you what the hit rate is on the energies because in one box we pulled like a ton but um, we did have fighting fire and another fighting one it does look like you will get one trainer with an auto on it. That'll be hollow per ETB. That looks pretty standard. Um, we did kind of pull trainer gallery cards in both boxes. So I can kind of say that that's kind of standard. But you don't really know how many you're going to hit. So we did have Thievil, Altaria, Lunatone, and Cricketune. And we didn't pull a VMAX in every box. Uh, but here we are with Neuralodon VMAX. So in this case... Of course, I only did the hollows right now, but if you had picked like the electric type, these would be the cards, your hollows at least, that you would come away with. Mareep with the uh, trainer gallery card, a lightning energy that would be hollow, and then the Zero Aura V Star. So that's if you were to pick the, you know, participate in the eBay break where we're going over the um, different types. You can pick a type, and there's three boxes, so it'd have been one more box. And then also, um, part of the break, as you can see, the ETBs do come with a lot of different things. Um, two of the ETBs will be randomized at the end of the break. Uh, the top two people, every every type will be entered, but the top two people will get all of the ETBs and the content. So they'll get the uh, um, code card, they'll get the promo card, the uh, dice, the um, sleeves, all of that. So that's how that will work. I was going to do all three ETBs, but I'm thinking I'll use that third ETB box to sleeve the cards and the crowns in the sleeve. So I didn't want to send like one randomized third box that is going to be missing the sleeves, but I might still do it anyway. Hit me up in the comments. Do you care if I use the sleeves or should I not use the sleeves and just go ahead and add all three as part of the uh, randomization. So out of the types, um, at least three will walk away with e uh, ETB and all the contents. Definitely thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and check out that TCG player and eBay store link in the description of the video if you want to get in on any of these cards and check out eBay if you want to get in on that break. I'm honestly thinking I really want to do a V-Star Universe break. Based off this ETB, I mean, I couldn't really figure out what the hit rate is. So, I mean, let me know. Um, I definitely said if I get enough likes on that other video, I'll do the uh, V-Star Universe break. But um, I feel like I might need to now. Definitely let me know in the comments. Should I do the V-Star Universe break or continue to do the Crown Zenith break? Hit me up and let me know. We're going to do that. Um, yeah, if you're interested, hit me up. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Check out the socials in the description. Thanks for tuning in. And until next time, this is Complete Cards. And we're out of here.